Welcome back. In this video, we'll discuss how to create or download the ARM template. So we'll move on to the demonstration. So uh, for creating or uh, downloading an ARM template, first uh, uh, let us uh, create a resource uh, using the uh, portal. So after that, we can uh, download the uh, a template and and we can modify the template and using that template we can deploy the resources so first of all uh, say I want to uh, create a virtual machine along with the uh, uh, resource group uh, network vnet subnets and uh, network security group all the resources I want to create along with the virtual machine so I'll just go to virtual machines I add a virtual machine so existing there is no virtual machine and also before uh, starting the deployment we'll also verify whether we have any other resource groups so we have resource group named ACS and uh, network watcher and RG01 so I want to create a, a resource group with a different name and uh, inside that resource group I want to have my uh, resources so first go to the virtual machine press add so resource group I want to create a new resource group uh, I just want to give a name something like this ARMRG01 so to uh, represent it as a Azure Resource Manager resource group and my virtual machine name should be VM01 and uh, I want to deploy a Windows Server 2019 and uh, virtual machine size should be DS1 I'm selecting DS1 V2 and the username I'm just giving Comet and password I give uh, Comet 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and capital C. So I have given the username and the password and then I don't want to uh, use this option and then give next and I want to have a standard STD and I want to create a new uh, virtual network so I don't want this virtual network I want to create a new virtual network named uh, okay um hyphen vnet 01 so this is how I want my vnet and the address range should be 11.0.0.0 slash 16 and uh, the subnet name should be um, vnet01 hyphen uh, SN01 and the range should be 11.0.0.0 slash 24 and then uh, and also I want to uh, have a network security group um, okay uh, I'll do one thing I'll just go with the uh, <coughs> default network security group and uh, or else I'll go with the this option uh, yeah so I have configured the disk and then I want to have a new security group with RDP enabled I just leave the name as the default name and then I want to have the diagnostic account already I have one diagnostic account I'll use the same account that is the diagnostic storage account and then advanced and uh, and tag shall be okay I'll just give purpose this purpose is demo 
so this should this should be my tag of all the resources and then press review and create so uh, once the validation is passed so here you can see uh, an option to download the template for automation just press on that so we'll have uh, two uh, files that is the parameters and the templates so we can download this so just press on this option download so i want to store this in the lab folder so now the uh, template has been downloaded so in the next video we'll uh, discuss how to uh, edit this uh, uh, edit or modify this arm template until then bye bye